Hello, my name is Artis. I'm the administrator for Hope Cafe Ministry. Hope stands for helping others pray every day. Come on and hit the share button as you come in on today. Or you can also find me on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and on Twitter. Please follow me if you get a chance. And so today, this is called How to Pray Scripture in Your Prayers. Yes, when you add scripture to your prayers, it enhances your prayers. And the scriptures, that's God's word. So God is going to honor his word. And so it's like you're speaking God's language. So I want to just give you all some scriptures and then give you some examples on how you can add these scriptures to your prayer life but it doesn't have to be these scriptures necessarily you can find some scriptures that go with your situation and then add those to your prayer so the first scripture is in Isaiah 46 and 9 it says I am God and there is none like me so you can say father God I'm so glad that you are God and there is none like you father God you are mighty you are powerful you are amazing and you just continue to build from there the next scripture is Psalms 40 and 5 and it says many Lord my God are the wonders you have done father God I want to thank you that you are my Lord and my God there are many wonders that you have done. Lord, I've seen you doing before. I want to see you do it again. Um, also, Psalm 71 says, Lord, my God, I take refuge in you. Yes, Father God, I'm so thankful that I can take my refuge in you, Father God. You are a very present help in a time of need, Father God. Um, next, Psalm 62 and 5 says, yes, my soul found rest in God. My hope comes from him. Father God, I want to thank you that my hope comes from you and that my soul can find rest in you, Father God. I thank you for that. And so Isaiah 42 and 10 sings to the Lord a new song, his praise from the ends of the earth. Father God, I want to sing to you a new song. Father God, I want to praise your name from the ends of earth. Father God, I want to lift your name on high and bless your name. Next, Job 37 and 5. The Lord does great things beyond our understanding. Father God, I want to thank you that you do great things beyond my understanding, Father God. I want to thank you that your ways are not my ways. I want to thank you that your thoughts are not my thoughts. Last, 2 Corinthians 5 and 17 says, If anyone is in Christ, the new creation has begun. Father God, I want to thank you that I am a new creation in Christ, that all old things has passed away. I am a new creation, Father God. I thank you for that. I need you. Please continue to use me all for your glory. And so these are just some examples on how you can use scripture to enhance your prayer life. If you're just tuning in, my name is Artis. I'm the administrator for Hope Cafe Ministry. Hope stands for helping others pray every day. You can also find me on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter. I post prayers on those sites every day. So if you have some time, please go ahead and follow me on those sites because it'll be you praying to the Lord. And this will help build your relationship with the Lord and draw you closer to the Lord. And when the Bible says, when you draw near to me, I will draw near to you. So I want to get on here and share that with you all today. I hope this blessed you all. And um, that's all I have today. I thank you all for tuning in because you could have been anywhere else. And I want to say a blessing over each and every one of you that will see this now. And each and every one of you that will see it in the future. May God bless you. May God use you. And whatever you do, don't stop praying.